Okay, Ricky Brown goes to the tower with 16 points and two rebounds. We don't have a stack out of this, but it must be prodigious. Right, Bernard Fabiosa, the point guard, comes in now for Ricky Brown. Bernard Fabiosa yeah. playing with that injured hand. Once you know the inbounding, two minutes and four to go, three points lead for Great Face. Here's David Garcia. <laughs> For the second time tonight, our Coliseum partner, Bush G. Castro, has just said we're into the last two minutes of the ball game, and there's a foul given up by David Sergio. That would be his first personal one more. It's going to be 55 for him. Right. Bush E. Bush now playing with five personal at the field. Earlier, they went to David Sergio because uh, Michael Young Michael has five personal. We've got a, we've got a timeout. We'll be back. And the key for point lead, and that's why the player just left Alan three outside. Nobody picked him up and he was so hot. Okay, Arnie Robbins will be in running from the left flank line, time down to a minute and 49. You can see that on the right bottom side of your screen. Oh, my Marie is not on court, so. That's right. Well, you can feel the traction here in the air. It's so thick. I can feel it on my ears. Third person foul on Orchid and Cruz. I thought Mama Reed played quality minutes, very good at a game. Why Mama Reed? 10 rebounds and a 6 ball. Now it's 12, 14 points. No question about that. Michael Young picking up David Fairchild and he misses. Mark Fernandez beating Jerry Carpenter with a rebound. Here's a fast break into works for the one makers. The great face company man quick to come down on defense, forcing a half court pattern to be executed by the one makers. Here's Freddy Ubaldi inside the paint. He goes up to JP Yango. Okay, 10 seconds in the shot clock. Third kill. Isolation play. Both efforts of 5 each. And fortunes have changed again. It has swung in the direction of the blind. They're up by 1. 134 to 132. Actually, 133 to 132. Okay. So 1-1 by the blind. Okay, the scoreboard corrected itself. 133 to 132. Alex is fouled by Freddy Humaldi. Good foul to give up, but that foul is put in Tatuayi in penalty. Third personal foul of Freddy Humaldi. Tatuayi in penalty with a minute and four seconds remaining. Great day, four feet. And two fouls. Two team fouls, so they can still uh, foul twice. The smartest thing Great Day can do right now is to go on fishing expeditions. I think let's go to Alan again. He's really hot, very hot. Yeah, get the fish from Bernie Mabio. Oh, they left him alone. And oh, a golden opportunity squandered out of Michael Young, and Brady Fabiosa took so much pain trying to set up that trick for him. Boy, that hurt. That really hurt. With 43 seconds to go, Tantuan with the upper hand. 1-3-3 three, three to 1-3-2. Three, There's the isolation for Juan Fernandez, but the Jets want to go for it. Oh, it needs to make the circuit. Five on him. Obaldi. Six. Oh, he shook Brady Fabiosa off his track and put in a two-pointer. We're down to 29 seconds, a three point lead for Tatuani, we'll be right back. Is that this early, or will they get the first two points inside and maybe foul the player later I on? I think they will offer a two point okay. shot, unless uh, they can get Alonso to take three for a birdie. Because there's still 29 seconds to go. Even if they connect with a three point shot and equalize the count, uh, there will still be time for Tatuani to launch a counter offensive and come up with a winning basket. Here is Michael Young, he comes up with a two point shot. Very fast, fast, 25 seconds remaining. 135 to 134, just a one point advantage, and David Sergio, they have the luxury of playing the clock right now. They have to foul. They have to foul right but now. But it can be or Brown, it can be Kaidik or Young, rather. It can be Kaidik. It be, has to be. It can be Mr. Pioso there. Okay, he finally fouls very about it. With seven seconds to go, Joe, again, they, they wasted a lot of precious seconds there. Actually, Mr. Trivio, it didn't matter who had to foul. Alakai, he could have sacrificed himself. Okay, we're hanging on. We're hanging on, and we'll give you, we'll give you great taste coffee. We want to see how they're going to try to uh, get back. They, they have a one-point deficit and two shots for Freddy Ubaldi. Freddie Hivalde has been playing a very steady ball game all throughout. He refuses to succumb to the pressure. And so, oh, I can almost foresee a three-point lead here for Tantuai with only seven seconds to go for Great Face to come up with a triple. And that is all for the Well, 
Maybe it's fine with that. Yo, I made a mistake. It's not too short for Ferry Ubalde because they're not his penalty yet. So, problems really for Baby the Lupin here. They'll have to commit two fouls and seven seconds remaining. Oh, oh, that really is a grim prospect for the Great Day's Tommy Lakers. Whoever gets the ball, foul right away. Whoever gets the ball, foul right away. Foul. And then we have to do it again. We're not in penalty. All right, so that'll do the task of inbounding the ball for this employee, Rob Baker, is his Ponchi de la Cruz. He's proven himself to be an extremely reliable performer for Tulim Valenzuela, and that's why he's practically eaten up the playing time of Willie Nawal entirely. And Alan Kay Dick has been assigned a chore of trying to get that ball that away. That's going to steal here. Oh, it's five, five seconds five. to go. Five. That's Two it. seconds. That's it. That's it. This ball game belongs to the fly, and so they surge to a 2-0 lead in this best-of-seven series. A grim outlook in the horizon for the Great Days Coffee Makers.